app is basically a big scavenger hunt. There you go. Where players interact in the real world using their smartphone's camera to see and catch Pokemon. But to find them, players have to search far and wide, which has inspired many like Aaron Wynn here to get up and head outside. I go to the library all the time, but I really never noticed the park until a gym was right here. Real world landmarks like the Bentonville Square Fountain, parks and churches are tagged via the app as destination spots. I'll be back. And many are checking out new spots like Crystal Bridges for the first time, all in search of the popular creatures. I had to go around and stuff inside and out and it was really cool. I never would have thought I would go to a museum. Gotta catch them all. And meeting plenty of new people while playing. And they're so friendly. Like everyone just acts like they're friends whenever they're talking about the game. Now, though a lot of people will say how fun and social the game is, there are some dangers you'll want to watch out for as well. I'll be telling you more about that in my live report coming up at 6 on 4029.